It's day eight of our potato cleanse. We haven't cheated. We're eating practically no sugar, no dairy, no wheat, no oils. I'm actually feeling really good and I'm not dreading potatoes. I would say though that today is the first day where I was like, I could have a chocolate bar. I'd like some cake. I was thinking a little bit more about some of the uh, desserts especially that I really like. But overall, we've been doing a great job. Potatoes really do satiate your hunger and that is so important. And I think that's what makes this a, um, a cleanse that is sustainable for more than two, three, four days is that you don't actually feel hungry, especially if you take the time to make sure that you cook um, some tasty dishes. So yesterday I was asked two questions and then I got asked two more questions. So I'm going to answer them today in the video. Uh, so the first question was care of my sister. She wants to know how my bathroom is doing. So um, thank you for that question, first of all. Second of all, uh, yes, it's going well. <laughs> I am happy in the bathroom department. Um, I'm peeing like a racehorse because I tend to eat my potatoes in a more savory way, which means I have a lot more salt on it, and that makes me thirsty, and I'm drinking a lot more water one thing leads to another, and I spend a heck of a lot of time walking from my desk to the bathroom during a work day. Um, I'm also going number two regularly, and I'm very pleased about that. Not backed up at all. Um, I know that that's a worry for some people when it comes to potatoes, but no, I'm not feeling backed up at all. I'm definitely incorporating as many vegetables as I can, though, and that probably helps. So thank you to my sister. I'm doing just fine. The second question that I had was about staying vegan when this cleanse is done. So I liken this to a vegetarian or vegan Atkins in that, you know, you're really focused on one food group and that's all you're eating for a little while. Um, I don't particularly like meat. So could I see myself going back to being vegetarian? Yeah, I could see that. Can I see myself going vegan? I don't know. And that's the true answer. I've been doing a lot of reading. I've been doing a lot of research about it. I think there's something really beautiful about a vegan lifestyle. And I know I feel better when I'm not heavily focused on meat in my diet. Um, do I think I could go full-blown vegan? Honestly, I can't answer it yet. Um, I certainly don't expect my children to be vegetarian or vegan. Um, and I cook for them. So that's probably something to consider. I don't expect my husband to be vegetarian or vegan, and I cook for him too. So I think that that's something definitely to consider and to think about. But I'm open to that lifestyle, and I'm open to eating that way. So it's a wishy-washy answer, and it's not really even that good of an answer, but it's the only one I've got, so sorry. If you have a question, ask me. I'd love to answer it for you. Um, obviously based on my answer to my sister's question, I'm not shy about anything. So just ask away, but day eight of the potato cleanse still going strong. I know for sure we are going to make it to two weeks without cheating.